And they got a buzz now. They got out the buzz. We are watching. We're paying attention. Uh. We're tuned in. We're locked in now. Y'all got us. Y'all, y'all, y'all finally got us. Clink, clink. Damn, are you happy now? Y'all got us here, man. We are watching. We're too. No matter if y'all say it's because of, you know, I want to say that it's, you know, Angel Reese has caused more than y'all than than we think that she did. She she did it. She does she's, something. She can still market. market. She still grabs more people than Alyssa Thomas does. And she she's doing her thing this year. She's she's solid. She's having a solid year. Despite everything, she's having a solid year. She's having steals. She's she's getting rebounds, even though most of them are for her layups. She she's scoring points. She's in double figures. She's she's being solid. But the part about Caitlin Clark that kills me that people are harping on. They be like, well, she's not even she can't handle the physicality. She gets hounded more than any. How would I know anybody else could handle the physicality? Because they don't get played as physical as she does. They're not getting guarded 85 feet up the court. They're not getting bumped and pushed off screens every time when they don't even have the ball. Nobody else is getting guarded. They're not getting doubled and tripled team when they don't even have the ball like her. You know why you can do that? Because her team is not as good. So if you put her on a team with good players where she doesn't have to have the accountability that she has right now on this bad team that she's on and she really she's the best shooter you could put her in a corner she don't have to handle the ball the whole game like she has to do with the fever she can sit in the corner and <laughs> use her shooting ability and you can kick it to her because they're not going to leave her or if they don't leave if they leave her she shoots wide open shots and who would you rather shoot open shots than her and if they stay with her guess what Asia wilson is sliding down the middle of the room to fucking layups guys or be honest just layups they're getting that so the count, what she has to do for the fever team, she won't have to do for team for the Olympics. She's the best shooter in the league. Off the dribble, yeah. front, wide open. You think they're yeah. keeping her open? She has to get her shots like she does because how she's being guarded and because they don't run offense for her like anybody else to get her open shots like Steph Curry, like Clay Thompson. She's not getting staggers and stuff like that to get her open. If they are, they're not setting amazing screens because there are a couple people that's on her every freaking time. So imagine her on a team where you can't put all the attention on her and she has to open fucking shots. Imagine what that does for the team. Or if they do co collapse on her, other players are getting layups. Imagine what that does for her when she doesn't have to bring the ball up the court all the time and handle the rock. Imagine what that does for her or the team. She's amazing. Y'all y'all are y'all are put y'all are overthinking. She you know you know how you know that she's better than a lot of these players? Because she's being guarded differently than anybody else in the league. That just shows you yeah. how good or her impact is on the court. So other days when Steph Curry doesn't score the ball all the time, but you see Draymond gets 12 assists, that's because of Steph Curry. Because they double him and he passes to Draymond and Draymond has a 4-on-3. That's the situation and that's the impact that Caitlin will bring to the team. Did you, did you, did you hear? Yeah, basketball to people because they be all in my... And I'd be like, yo, I play ball. I know ball more than a lot of y'all. I, I promise y'all, I should have been a coach in basketball, but it was just that I was good enough to go play professional football. But if not, I wasn't good enough to play basketball at that level higher. But my mind, I guarantee you, is a lot better than a lot of y'all minds when it comes to basketball. My high school coach would tell y'all that I should have been a coach and I could have did it. Thank you for watching Come On Now, the podcast. Please be sure to subscribe, like, comment, and ring that bell so you get up-to-the-minute updates when we publish new content. You can also find us on Facebook and Instagram at Come On Now Podcast and X and TikTok at Come On Now Pod. Thank you again for supporting this channel.